The pink Pilates princess trend is an aesthetic that has taken over Pinterest, TikTok, and YouTube. It incorporates things like self-care, exercise, and healthy habits into your daily routine. So today, I thought I would try out this trend to see what the hype is all about and if it's actually worth it. Good morning, everybody. I thought it would be fun for us to live like a pink Pilates princess for an entire day. Of course, we started with our wellness morning routine. I feel like the pink Pilates princess always has a really solid self-care morning routine where she prioritizes things like skincare and wellness to set up the whole entire day for success. doing my morning skincare routine by the way i wanted to remind you guys that just because products are pink doesn't mean that it's necessarily good i would recommend you to search up which skincare is best for yourself so let's do a little bit of makeup today My hair is kind of greasy today, but we're living with it. It kind of matches the ribbons on my phone case. I actually did makeup today and I feel like I look so good today. I got this pink ribbon shirt on and let's make some matcha and then do a little bit of matte Pilates at home. I look so cute. It's so good. Now let's make some breakfast. do some matte pilates from a youtube video i have my yoga mat right here so let's set it up sorry if my place is a little bit messy right now i think that i'm going to do these 30 minute pilates by move with nicole something that i've always wanted to try is reformer pilates like at an actual studio and stuff but we're gonna get there we're gonna get there i'm gonna build up the courage to book a session someday i'm gonna inhale reach your reach up. Seventh grade, you knew every crush of mine. We'd always talk online. And now that we're all grown up, you've disappeared for a while. Wish that I knew why. I think it's been about six months. Did you forget about our plan? Share this video with a friend. Okay, we are done with this little Pilates workout. I am sweating a little bit. I actually used to do Pilates so much like two years ago, and I don't know why I stopped doing it. Definitely killed my glutes, it killed my abs. Yeah, it's really, really difficult. I am inspired to do this again in the future, 100%. So let's roll this back up and then now I want to do some cleaning, some laundry for the apartment. One thing that I did want to mention is that even though this is a pink Pilates 
princess day in the life i don't want you guys to feel pressure to buy new yoga mats or new clothes or anything like that if you already have them but if you want to of course you can do that for me obviously i didn't buy a new yoga mat and i kept the same water bottle that i've always had uh, and i think that this trend what i want it to mean for everybody is to prioritize wellness to be able to do new things you don't have to buy new pink things if you don't need it and that's something that i was considering doing i was like oh for this video like should i buy a new yoga mat should i buy a new water bottle and that was a hundred percent not necessary so i felt that pressure to like just consume more things within these types of trends i think that at the end of the day it is just prioritizing wellness and feeling good and wearing things that make you comfortable if pink isn't your favorite color you can wear other colors it doesn't really matter but yeah and also just trying new things like pilates or retrying it again to inspire you let's start doing a little bit of laundry for today I'm gonna have some dumplings for lunch. My grandma used to make the best homemade dumplings and it's something that I really miss since she's passed away. Dumplings are one of my favorite foods for sure. I need to look in there, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Isn't that a little too close? Uh, no. I just got a package. I'm actually going on vacation in exactly one week, but I just bought two sets of bikinis and also a cover up. Oh, it looks so cute. So, this is the first one. It's a little pink bikini top and bottom that I got and then I also got this blue floral one I think they're both adorable all of this is from garage by the way and then I also got this crochet cover up I think it will be so cute I'm so excited for the vacation that's incoming <laughs> Hello guys, it is a little bit later. We are going to be doing a self-care night and everything shower. I think that a huge aspect of the Pink Pilates Princess trend is also prioritizing self-care. So that is why we are going to be doing that today. Some of these tips, I literally wish I knew years ago, but I really didn't. I'm gonna start with taking off my makeup. I'm going to be using, I'm gonna be using a cleansing oil. This is the very first thing. I used to use micellar water and the like little pads all the time but it was really abrasive on your face so double cleansing with a cleansing oil or a cleansing balm is where it's at you just take away your makeup so much easier than if you just used micellar water or a makeup wipe and then we want to wash it away with warm water <laughs> Next, we want to take another like real cleanser to double cleanse our face. Now let's hop into the shower and wash our hair. What I always do before showering my hair is I brush out any tangles and mix things a lot. Oh. Oh it makes things a lot easier when I wash it. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not the biggest expert on hair masks, so you guys let me know if I'm doing this right. Okay guys, it is 10 minutes later. In the shower, I'm gonna double shampoo. Fully rinsed off all of the conditioner. I clip it back up and then I use this silicone loofah. So let's take a shower. Okay, now let's do some of our nighttime skin. 
skincare. I just let my hair air dry. I think that overall the pink Pilates princess trend is something that can be really fun to implement within your life to try to romanticize it and try new things like Pilates if you haven't already or to reinvigorate some of your inspiration for taking care of yourself. I think that it's important to remember to not feel pressured to buy new products or buy new things. I think the pink Pilates princess is more so focused on just prioritizing wellness no matter if you have pink pink things or not. Anyways, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already and I love you. I hope to see you back soon.